Blackburn, the Get Well Reader Chancellor, heat number two, set to jump. Ready? Off and running now, bouncing away in front, little Morona, top of road, going to the leaders, eat some cake down and out of the straight. They were followed by uh, Zipping Bruce. Behind them there was Miracle as they travelled to the bagger. And then came Ben Poppy, a good way back to Frank the villain. And Baggett Street at the tail of the field, down the back, eat some cake, the leader. Zipping Bruce is giving chase strongly as they travel to the turn, followed by top of road. And then a good way back to little Ramona around the turn. And the leader is eat some cake in second place, Zipping Bruce. But eat some cake, beat Zipping Bruce followed by uh, Topper Road getting up to run fourth Frank the Villain followed by Miracle and then came uh, Little Ramona the next one in was Bent Poppy and the other one there was Baggett Street the winner is number five eat some cake bounced out in front and has to fight all efforts to run it down they had their chances to pick it up and they couldn't five two and eight the numbers the winner number five eat some cake Lock and Bar Mullo, Baker Cake owned by the 2325 syndications manager Kay Deacon and trained by Ben Sweetman. Two Zipping Bruce second, Mantra Lad Scarlet Girl for Scott Austin. Number eight, Topper Road third by Oaks Road, you know, MI for Caroline Hughes. Fourth going to number 10, and that was Frank the Villain. Five, two, eight, and 10, 447, 1708, 30 and 29, and that run home time was 1321. Winning margin coming up. Number five, Eat Some Cake, has scored officially by one length. A length of winning margin, two lengths, 5, 2, 8 and 10. Going to be a good quality here tonight at Gosford.